right, seeing smoke in the air in Florida this time of year, it's pretty normal actually. Yeah, but so many people, they call the newsroom, they ask us, what's that smoke we see in the air? What's going on? Well, how do you know the difference if it's really a controlled burn or not? We are getting the questions and now we've got the answers. The Now's Adam Weiner went behind the fire line today to show us what it does to protect us. Fire is not the enemy here in the forest of Hillsborough County. It's natural. The fire is putting ash on the ground, nutrients in the soil. It's also removing overgrowth so that the wildflowers, the native wildflowers and grasses can come back. Environmental Outreach Coordinator Andy Fairbanks of Hillsborough County, one of several people today burning a part of Lithia near the Alafia River. Prevent wildfires yep. and provide the natural fire that keeps the forest healthy. Since Florida has a dry season and a lot of lightning, the wildlife here adapted to benefit from fire. Tried to light. If it doesn't light very good, come on back out to where the fuel is a little bit better out there and light it there. So the county tries to mimic on a small level what would happen naturally. If we don't have regular uh, fires based on like a, a natural interval that consumes that fuel, it can build up real dense pockets of fuel and that's where it's a risk of wildfire. Wildfires, like the kind seen recently in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Controlled burns are a near daily activity here in Florida. The Hillsborough County unit today burning about 375 acres of the some 80,000 acres that they oversee. Today's burn will take them all day to conduct. Crews were especially busy this weekend ahead of the big storm, which could have been a big threat. They were able to come in and put a line in for us. Those preparations help prevent those winds from starting a bad wildfire. In Tampa, I'm Adam Weiner for the now Tampa Bay.